But if you close your eyes Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, in this scripting tutorial I'm going to be teaching you how to make a teleport part that will teleport the, teleport the player to another location when they touch it. So to start you're going to need to insert a part by clicking the part button at the top of your screen. You can then scale, design, and make this part look however you want, it should not affect the script. And now make sure once you have your explorer and properties open, insert a script into this part. And inside of the script, you need to write script dot parent dot touched colon connect function hit <clears throat> local player equals game dot players colon get player from character open bracket close bracket hit dot parent and then say if player then player dot character dot humanoid root part dot c frame equals c frame dot new and then put whatever location you want them to go to so for example say you had a part over here on the side of the map that you wanted them to go to you could go into this copy the position and then paste it in those brackets and then make sure this part's anchored so it doesn't just disappear and then click play now once this loads if you walk over to this and walk onto it it'll teleport you to your chosen location way over here this will work with R15 and R6 so it doesn't matter which one you're using because this will work with either or and then say you wanted to add a teleporter so that they could get back you could just put another one over here a little bit next to where you teleport them to and then get the location a little bit next to the teleporter just so it doesn't spam teleport them back and forth when they land if they land on top of it and then inside of the new script you could just paste the location of the second one was that the size of the location? I think I might have gone the wrong value. Uh, no, I got the right one. So now when we test it, that um, new part next to where we teleport should teleport us right back. Because it's just changing the position value. You can get any position by just importing a part and copying the position of where you want the player to go. Yep, right here and back. And that will work with R15 and R6. And it's that simple, that's all you need to make a teleport script for your game so you can teleport players all around the map in an instant. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more scripting tutorials in the future, and I'll see you all in the next video.